Born in 1960, Phil Waldrop became a Christian at the age of seven. As a teenager, he began preaching in small rural churches in North Alabama and was later ordained as a Southern Baptist evangelist. Phil is now known as an effective and powerful evangelist, author, and conference speaker. Following God's direction, Phil formed the Phil Waldrop Evangelistic Association in 1980 to share the gospel and provide quality conferences and resources to help people grow in their relationship with their Heavenly Father, families, and friends. In 1984, Phil Waldrop posted his first conference, a student event, and by 1992, more than 1,200 students were attending the annual event. Realizing a need for encouragement and Christian development for all ages, several additional conferences were formed. Women of Joy, a three-day, two-night women's conference, which has featured such speakers as Kay Arthur, Sarah Palin, and Priscilla Shire. Gridiron, a new men's conference that is held on the campuses of the beautiful SEC colleges. Celebrators, where mature believers come together for a four-day conference packed with great worship and renowned speakers, such as Dr. David Jeremiah and former President George W. Bush, and Connect Student Conferences, which are still ministering to students with popular music artists and speakers. Even with the recent economic downturn, conference attendance has doubled. After preaching in New England during a mission trip in 1984, the Lord impressed upon Phil an overwhelming desire to reach New England for Christ. One of Phil Waldrop Ministries' most cherished events is the annual Pastor's Encouragement Retreat, held annually in New England at a beautiful resort. Because of the generosity of those who attend Phil Waldrop Ministries' conferences, the entire retreat is free of charge for any pastor and spouse that wish to attend. The Pastor's Encouragement Retreat provides a time of encouragement and spiritual renewal for pastors and their spouses who may be spiritually drained from serving in such a difficult area of the United States. Each year they leave the retreat refreshed and with a newfound zeal for their ministries. At an early age, Phil Waldrop began working as a disc jockey at WHIY in Moulton, Alabama where his love for radio began. When he was 12 years old, he received his FCC third class broadcast license with endorsement, becoming one of the youngest people in the United States to receive it. Years later, encouraged by his close friend, David Jeremiah, Phil Waldrop is a man of God. He's a man of great vision. God has given him a heart for pastors that is evidenced by the great things that he does for pastors in the rural areas of New England. I know that God has his hand upon this man's life. He has a good wife, a wonderful family, and I believe that he's on the threshold of his greatest days. The vision for Living with Joy was born. Living with Joy went on the air across the United States on October 5th, 2009 and its debut far exceeded all staff and consultants' expectations. Today, Living with Joy is broadcast in 49 of the 50 states. Through God's provision for the future, Bill Walter Ministries is poised to take their conferences into new cities across America and to take Living with Joy into new markets. Plans are in the works for a daily short feature to expand their radio outreach to music intensive stations. They're also looking to develop television specials so that a larger audience can experience the encouragement of joy of the Phil Waldrop Ministries conferences. The mission of Phil Waldrop's media ministries is to impact more lives for Christ on a daily basis by being dedicated to helping people live their lives to the fullest. Won't you prayerfully consider joining with Phil Waldrop Ministries as we share the joy of the gospel of Jesus Christ around the world. Won't you join us?